so today I'm going to do an unboxing of Chanel bag that I recently got from Taiwan. I've been wanting this bag for a few years now, but since we don't have Chanel boutique in our country, it is not easy for us to acquire one. Well, there are a lot of personal shoppers or resellers, but personally, I prefer buying it directly from the boutique. Since our, our time in Taiwan is very limited, I want to make sure the availability of the bag before going there. So I think a few weeks before our trip, I started calling uh, Chanel Taiwan hotline and each time they just keep on telling me that it is not available. And since it is a very hot item in Taiwan, um, it could be available in the boutique but it may not reflect in their system. So I should just go directly to the boutique. Um, I also reached out to our friends from Chanel FB group if anyone can share their SA contacts with me and fortunately a very nice lady responded to my request so I want to give a big shout out to Cartel. Thank you so much dear for introducing me to Nock who is very accommodating. Um, that's why it is unfortunate that I wasn't able to get the bag from him though I really really wanted to. But what happened is when I arrived in Taipei, he told me that this bag is no longer available in their store. And since I'm desperate to get this bag, I still try to go to other boutiques. There are three uh, Chanel fashion boutiques in Taipei. Number one is at Regent Boutique, in Sogo Boutique, and at Shinkong Mitsukoshi uh, department store. Uh, I went to the Regent Boutique and luckily, it is available there and I met a very sweet sales associate. Her name is Serena. Um, Serena is very patient, very informative. She gave me an amazing experience and we really had a great conversation. So, I enjoyed our time at the boutique. So, yeah, um, enough rumbling and let's go to the unboxing. So here is the receipt. So in Taiwan, there is 5% VAT refund for tourists, but it is subject to 14% handling fee. So in my case, I paid 162,900 NTD, and it has a VAT refund of 7,757, but there is a handling fee of 1,085. NTT so I was able to get a VAT refund of 6,672 I did claim my refund at the airport and at the customs you have to present the bag I don't know if that is always the case well you just have to show the item to them very quickly they didn't even touch it um, and if you want to exchange your refund to your currency there is a 100 NTD charge. Okay, so here is the paper bag. Let's just take the box out. Here is the box, beautifully wrapped in Chanel white ribbon and has a camellia. Okay, let's open this baby up.
and I got Chanel Classic Flop Medium in Black Caviar Leather and Silver Tone Hardware. Oh my goodness, I never thought I will be able to get this item, especially for weeks that I've been calling um, Chanel Taiwan Hotline. They just, they just keep on telling me that it is sold out, not available. Yeah, and uh, we only have a very limited time, so I can't check it in other parts of Taiwan. I can only try my luck in Taipei. That's why I'm very happy that I was able to get this item. I went for this combination because I already have a classic flap jumbo in gold hardware, which is also in caviar leather, and an old medium boy in black caviar leather and also in gold hardware. Also, when I'm deciding between the silver and the gold hardware, I realized that I really want the look of the medium classic flap in silver hardware. Especially, I'm planning to use it during casual days. I really don't have that much um, night events to go to. And the only reason that I can think of why I should get the gold hardware is most of my jewelries are in gold and to be honest i really don't mind mixing metals i do it all the time so yeah i just went for what i really like and get this bag and no regrets i also want to mention i love the caviar this season um personally i think it is way more pebbled or embossed i'm not sure if i'm using the right word but it really feels sturdy but of course, we will only know the quality over time. But comparing it to my Jumbo, which is an 18 series, the caviar is more grainy. <laughs> I don't know, but I like it. Um, this is made in Italy. Personally, I don't mind getting either made in Italy or France. So that's it, guys. Thank you for letting me share the new addition to my small Chanel collection. Mm, yeah, so until next time, bye guys!